Let me just make sure. Appears to be working, I think. All right. All right, so hopefully this works. Time to play my favorite game, US Carrot AC. Yeah, I know I'm using like a crappier mic right now because of the current setup I have. I don't have access to my lap to my actual computer right now, so this laptop sucks. But あきら。僕は自分の命に変えてでも守りたいものがたくさんある。もしその時が来たら、ほう、何度転生しようともか。人間は救うな。That's <笑> Akira。Akira。Yeah, this game does look really nice. It's a lot of fun to play too. Alright, I guess I'll skip text now. The main character is named Nanashi, and this is Asahi here. That's all I know about him, really. Uh, I forgot what this is. Anarchy is true end. Uh, it's one of the two, uh, like, neutral endings of the game. It's either anarchy or peace. The peace ending is, like, more anime. Anarchy is, I haven't really seen it yet. But, yeah, they're both, like, the true end. You both fight Yeva at the end. Okay, I forgot these two. Okay, we get the same choice again. But it goes over the first game. 
to like catch you up on where you are in the story. This is in the neutral path. Mm. This is the best oh, guy yeah. right here. So the way, <laughs> he literally oh, says Yaman if you listen to the dialogue. Alright, uh, yeah, I like this yeah. go, boy. The music's good too. I forgot where you get the phone, is it over here? Get something. I guess you have to visit both, regardless. Okay, it is the Now we can summon demons. I think. Alright, now we enter our name. The name I used last run as well. Uh, there's an yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. These are some nice backgrounds. This is a nice background. Wild plant foot. Okay. Kakua, Sorewa, Masakado Koto. I bet this scene looks really cool in English, by the way. But... Oretachiwa. Find that sky tower and the archangels, whatever. One of the things that sucks about this game is all the cutscenes at the start, though. It's literally an hour of cutscenes and, uh, like, introductory stuff. If you don't zip through it, like I'm doing. We did it. Oh, this is the cool thing. See, see the bottom three right here. There's like a little flag down here. Oh, I just tapped the wrong thing. If you tap the flag, it'll show you like on the map where you have to go. So it's always pretty straightforward. This is the only reason I was able to complete the game, but after every door. Kalpas. Ah. Yeah, I mean, they were a pretty cool part of the game. You can't just throw them like any SMT though. It kind of not make sense for SMT4, I guess. That's kind of the thing with it.
cutscene is over. See this checkpoint flag is so helpful. Okay, so you go to bed, you go to the bar. That's most of the early game. Pretty much it's just that. Does it work on overworlds? Uh, yeah, it does. Like, it'll show you the point on the overworld you have to go to. Okay, we have to talk to Beaker, I think. Yeah. Oh, sure. <laughs> Some of this down, but it'll be important. Okay, now I leave, I think. I don't think we have to talk to the guy. Oh, apparently. Now we go on demons. Pretty sure it's this way. Don't check. Yeah, sometimes it's a little ambiguous where it is, but it's usually pretty straightforward. It might be my imagination, but I think the text skip is a lot faster in this. Oh, you're gonna start running SMT1. That, that sounds pretty interesting. I haven't actually run the game. All I know is that you put all your points into the main character's speed so that you can run away from everything. Pretty funny. Manabuga, Omaira ni tatakai kata o tutorial. Yeah, yeah. Shikata. Okay. No, just fight a couple of these, I forget how many. They don't let you use auto battle in the start, that's pretty funny. No, it's a little bit boring. Yeah, I heard about it. It's like some sword that lets you auto battle bosses or something ridiculous. Uh, how hard is he? Uh, it it kind of depends how good your late game setup is. If you're like over leveled, he probably won't have a problem, but if you aren't, he might. Uh, he's definitely the most fun boss in the game by a large margin. Uh, 
Yeah, it would probably be a lot easier in English, because I think there's something with uh, removing his weaknesses, or like, removing his resistance to the story into weaknesses, but because I can't read what weakness it is, I just have to guess. So that was a little bit challenging. This is the part where we all die. This is one of the weirder demon designs by a lot. Yeah, I don't know either. Like, they're both like level 8 or something. It's ridiculous. Right. <laughs> yeah, I don't get it either. The end of the game. <laughs> nah, he's gone. So, just a story. Yeah, yeah, it's the whole game. You know, it was pretty fun. We got to fight like two demons, two and a half, if you count black. Noise it makes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is right where you fight Yama. That, that, that's his voice actor right there. Yeah, this area does look pretty sick. But like, it's hard to tell if this dream is so bad, but uh, if you look at the, like, the environment or whatever, mm -hmm. it looks really sick. It's a shame you only have to go down here once. This is the demon who brings you back to life. Uh, he also levels you up to four instantly. So, uh, I don't know, let's see. So, this is, uh, it goes strength, dexterity, magic, uh, ability, luck. So I guess like a magic build would be best for like a speedrun. 
Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely get that. Like, it's five minutes, thirty minutes. But I just like I couldn't wait for the depth for the marathon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. 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 But the thing is, like, there's nothing scary in the early game at all. Like, you just want to blow stuff up, honestly. It might even be better to go for a strength build, but I don't really know. I actually gotta think a little bit because it takes a little while for you to get magic. Uh, yeah, you know, it might be better to be a game. Like, uh, has all the stupid RNG. Uh, it is like, there are, if you get to the end of this game, some of the dungeons get like really, really long. Well. I mean, if you have a route, then it's fun, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it, that's basically all the start is. You just reset until you get the good recruits and a good early game going, and then you just go ball. That's all it is. Because, like, you don't get magic for a while, and you do get piercing by the end of the game anyway. So, like, even though piercing works for magic as well, like, there aren't really any downsides to going full physical. Well, there's, like, each character is, like, a kind of, like, awakening skill that they get at a certain point in the story, and the main character gets a skill that lets him do pierce with everything. So that that's pretty job like especially in the last boss. Because the last boss is just everything. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking as well. I'll at least try physical, if not the mean like go some other thing. The only thing with physical is that you might have to buy physical equipment. But, it'll be fun there. You could also start physical and then go magic. Because, like, the thing is, while you don't start with magic for a while, there's only a limit to, like, how much putting into magic actually helps you. It, like, more so in this game than SMT4, I felt like, towards the end. So, you could just, like, put it in strength to make the early game a bit faster. The thing is, I do still have like summer classes and work to do, but it's a lot less than uh, what's it called? A lot less than over like actual semesters. So hopefully I'll have some time too, and I'll get it done. But maybe not. We'll see. I forget, another cool thing this game does, they just give you Centaur at the beginning of the game. Pretty nice. Thank you. 
and then they run away. Now. SMT for all that things. Well, uh, good luck with that. If you manage to do the whole thing, you'll probably hold the world's only record in that. Alright, let's see. Right, we have to talk to the bartender, Ozzy. Yeah, it would be pretty easy. You would just like you can start wherever. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, exactly. Be pretty straightforward. All right, this is where we have to go recruit you. Now this is where I know for what to do. Like, I know I should recruit something, but... I mean, you don't really even have to grind that much. Like, the thing is, you can, like, do just enough to go through the game, and then use all of your quest experience for doing the rest to keep finding all the other stuff. That's why I mean. Yes. Yes. Oh, he left. Okay. I don't know what that was. I mean, I don't think it's a plus. Like, all neutral route is, is just more of what's in the other routes. Uh, second one. First one. And he's angry. See, I, I don't really know what goes on here. That's, that's the main problem. First option. Uh, first option again. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I kind of figured. I'm just gonna recruit a bunch of stuff and then see what they do to do, probably. See, I don't know if this would be better or worse if I could understand this language. Uh, 
Three. Okay, I don't know what happened there, but... Uh, let's... I need to think about what to recruit, honestly. Obviously not slime, we can't understand it. Yeah, I mean, it is a pretty, like, interesting run, I guess. It's just actually completing it is nightmarish. It might still be, like, less than 20 hours, which is not as bad as it could be, but still pretty bad. 22 monster, sure. HP, that's fine. Alright. Now we need a little bit of up, I guess. So that guy has Zeo skills, that's interesting. I think now I can start playing into magic. Yeah, I have some of the... Oh, damn, I'm going Right, no, no, no. Get that one. Um, I don't know if it'd be quite that much, depending on how your law route goes. Yeah, exactly. Law is like the crux of the whole run. Which I guess is okay, because it's right at the beginning. If it goes wrong, you can start over at the beginning. But... Oh, this is what we need. For sure. This is the thing that has the D as skill. We'll just go with it. Oh. Uh, yeah, sure, take one of those. I have four. HP is fine. MC is fine. HP again. Eh, I'm gonna say that's enough, buddy. Alright. You still haven't done law, I think. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's not a whole lot to it. It's just actually getting to the end part of it, really. Oh, this is the most broken part of the game by far. Having partners. Guys, how are I heard that dialogue, at least. So, put it back. Yeah, I'll get to it. I actually haven't played uh, Vanilla SMT4 in a long time, so that'll be interesting heading back to that. Yeah, that'll probably be my next step. So I have a vague idea of where I have to go, because they mentioned Sky Tower. But... Is that where you fight Angel, I think? Yeah, like, see, this is where, what the flag looks like on the little world. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and... Yeah, I mean, New Game World is just that one. Like, even in my test run, which honestly went really well, like, it, it was an hour and 45 before I got past the minute bar, so, I mean, we just have these easy difficulty at that point, I think. It's not a whole lot of other ways about it. Unless you like resetting.
I think you can actually find Decorabias already in the wild out here. Oi! Oi. Uh, first one. Okay. Honestly, there's even more RNG after that though. Because you have uh, Pluto, is also pretty RNG heavy. Uh, Kedji can be a little bit, because you're already like really under level by then. And then, uh, what else? Obviously, Lucifer at the end. That's a lot as well. I think you should do a little bit of grinding before uh, what they call the angel fight. This is a little bit tough, not that tough. Something to I guess. I might be a defuse something. These are really easy. We get a lot of experience pretty quickly. This is the decorative here. Yep. <laughs> hey, look. I'm at level 55 or whatever already. Now let's see. I think we should kill. Should have killed another one first. <laughs> Alright, nice. I'm good at this. <laughs> yeah, I cheated. You got me. And let's see what we got here. Our recruit is this thing with that. Uh, that's boo foo when it gets on those things. That's okay if you're using it again. Oh, well. And Tor is obviously a monster as always. Uh, this thing is honestly pretty terrible, but it is okay if magic is here, I guess. And this gets two healing. I think this right here highlighted is the uh, I'm like 90% sure of that. And then another one's probably Potra or something like that. This thing is obviously very, very important. Uh, this thing, these two can give or take Centaur support. And characters are not Yeah, that's the Let's check out Fusion. This guy's the best uh, Japanese voice actor also. <laughs> but that's the entire, the entire reason why you play the Japanese version. Alright, yeah, I don't know if can't use anything. Yeah, I mean, it's not like, well, it has a whole lot in it, but and it does have some pretty interesting plus that if you do you know, play Master Mode, that's pretty funny, and get his fusion. There's also another one that I can't remember, like, as a comic or something. Anyway. These are both too high levels. 
Kevin to go and get Another cool thing about Smirk is that it induces weakness or like gets a crit or something. Whatever you do. Unless they're walking up to it. I wanna like level up these demons and know where they give skills that just having MC with healing would be really going away early in the game. I mean, this one, I guess you don't have to level up. So you can do that for now. There seems to be a lot more tutorials in this one as well. But anyway, right here. Oh, uh, that was my party. Okay, yeah, party was fine, I guess. The map team is really good too. Like the old one was fine. They didn't really have to make a new one. There is a mini boss here though. So those games take us that when we take on the angel. They changed how uh, Alma and Mudo work. So instead of being instant kills, now they just deal damage like Foo Foo or something. It's really, really strange. But it makes Alice even more OP than she was in the first game. Yeah, I mean, I like it more than the other missions because they will think that the players are going to be used and the enemies are also used. I mean, I think it's fun. Well, and we got a plus one. Oof. So it like, does maybe two more damage. Worth it. So, yeah. okay. Oh. Okay. Alright. <laughs> this is pretty funny. <laughs> These guys just run away. And leave us with this. Oh wait, no, they die. Well, you know. Now we have to fight this early game. <laughs> 
<laughs> Don't worry guys, we got this. We had a little rocky start, but I, I think we can come back. Yeah, you know, we're almost matching the attempt of his damage output. Alright, okay, he killed that one, that's fine. That's fine, we, we've endured worse. Uh, let's see. Maybe we'll try getting our extra boosty damage. Uh, yeah, yeah, you have to beat this guy. You can't really get past the game of money deal. So, that isn't a lie either. Like, you literally have to beat this guy. Oh, also, your partner revives all the time. So, okay, so, I live with 1 HP, talking about gods and stuff. And then, uh, oh, okay. No, it's the fourth win! Alright, now we win. I mean, we do almost as much damage as split by this point. Okay. Now this is a lot easier. Yeah, you know. I do like maybe one hundredth of that damage. This is still does way less damage than he does. Yo, we killed him. We got the last hit. It's okay, we beat him. Flynn, it's kind of strange because at the beginning of the game, Flynn is way more powerful than everything else and you wonder why you're even needed. And then by the end of the game, you wonder why Flynn's even needed because he sucks. Because you're way more powerful than he is. あなたたち。You have to have him on your team. Uh, only super super late game. You have to you get him on your team. Oh yeah. So basically, uh, in the Yava dungeon, he follows you around and does his own thing. Where's the next quest? Oh, yeah, I have to talk to the guy. Okay, it's no more. Uh, oh, this lets us change our name if we want. Or are we telling him what our name is? Wow, you have so many options uh, for characters. Holy crap. Look at this. You get the whole Greek alphabet? Hello? No, let's change our name to something that's not how it's one day. I gotta get it here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I'll be the table. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'll just name it this. Does it not let me? It's not letting me. Come on. 
That sucks. Um, the touch screen is going to work. Uh, apparently, that's fine. Asagi, Ome mo cha cha to hunt. Uh, I don't know what anything to do. We're just gonna say that one. Oh, this is review, I think. Uh, <laughs> it's the letter D. So I actually forget what you do after this. Oh, right, this is where you meet the Lord. Is this do you meet go to the fairy forest then I guess? Yo, hey, well, what's up, Navar? Oh right. I forgot you have to actually if demons have an item on level enough, you actually have to go to the menu and talk to them. Like, oh, he wants to change his skill. That's fine. Now he knows the other as well. Alright, let's check her out again, because I literally don't remember. Looks like a letter. That is this one. I guess you now we can scan areas or something. I never really understood why this cutscene takes 15 seconds or whatever. So, if you see something like this, it's like a channel quest thing that you can try to do. But there's never really any point. I literally have a cutscene now to explain this guy.
So yeah, they literally force you to explore the whole area first before you go I also skipped over something that I can go through here. Let's go right here. So, before you didn't know how many relics you had on hand, but it keeps a counter for you so that you always know how much you have. Like right below the first one of the green. Oh, that was a pretty cool addition. Gonna make running a little easier for me. Bring up these weeds. Where you get the the bar power up. Those are great. I never learned my way around the time here because the first time you get here, you just go downstairs. Make you think this is those on me from the first game. Showing my trailer. So. Yeah, it is really cool. I agree. It reminds me almost of Etrian on the team with the way it looks. I think we meet the actual one that will be here. Yeah. Kora 
ちょっとなパンや急に抱きつかないで離れなさいああの娘妖精だったのか悪魔この依頼罠だったのあなたたち人外ハンターなのちょ,ちょっと待ってスマホを下ろしてこの子<笑> She's another important character in the story, but I'm not sure what her role is. Yeah, you fight Odin like one and a half times.、Uh, I say one and a half because one of them is supposed to be. Odin is just not looking really nice. Uh, Odin, the three Roku, and Krishna are the three main like, villains, I guess, of the polytheistic lines. <laughs> HP, sure. The bonus, sure. 15 And it r u n s Well, you know. That we have to go. I think you have to go the other way. I think. Yeah. I honestly forget how this stuff. And I don't know how I'm going to beat the guy at the end either. Okay. What levels are these?、Um, well, we are level 9. We can recruit this one, I guess. They put m o n s t e r in the early game too. There's like some like normally early game demons that are in the late game. Let's try this guy. I need a n g r y Thing like, oh, I'll hold forward after I get out of there and I just walk right back in. Uh, let's see what these are. That one's 12, I remember that, so we can't recruit any of these.
very This is a level 2. This is probably something good. Mm. If it has a level 2. You get really nice skills down here. The two support skills. I didn't know that actually. That's pretty funny though. Maybe we should kill one of these first. 
everything. The party system is super broke. That's a weird glitch, her picture doesn't display properly. Like game demons, they give you the early game. I mean, these ones just give us the item. But... This is the mechanic I understand the least from. Like, yeah, I mean, it looks okay. I like the old one better, definitely. So what you do is you go to this like power spot or whatever, and Navarre gets his blade that he can use to destroy black mm. walls, and that's about it. And there's like a little meter on the right you can see that ticks down. <laughs> that's all it is. I don't get it. That's a mechanic. Oh, so as you walk around, the meter ticks down, so you can't just have him next to your side forever. He, he, he doesn't even like attack David or anything, he just does his own thing. Yeah, it is really stupid, I agree. Okay, so it's not worth coming back here for this bro. I don't really know what these do. Okay. Uh, it's right. Well, these, these are instances, I think. Yeah, okay. So they give you magic incense and fuck incense. Mm -hmm. 
after and he runs out of meter and he does the thing. go back. I feel like it was supposed to have been used as like a puzzle mechanic, but it just wasn't. Uh... Yo, okay, we found it. We're level 10 now, I can see things, so I should probably do that. Okay. Uh, see. Oh yeah, so there's a plus and minus mechanic where like demon skills can be plus something or minus something if they were gotten from like depending on their strengths and weaknesses. So like Jack Frost has a lot of plus for ice, but a lot of minus for fire. So like, Angel here is weak to electricity, so she can't use Zero as well, you know? It's kind of an interesting mechanic, and I think it works pretty well. But... Right. 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 The companion, because there's probably something good we can get. Salty. Uh, what's this thing do? Trying to think of like getting some good early game skills for late game would be good demon for that. Gosh, good. This usually has some skill magic. This one's okay. Does it not let you fuse the cover right? Fuse the cover right. Let's look at what we call the apps as well. Yeah, Up here are like the standard uh the PNHP of the Okay, I think this one expands the number of skills you can use by one, I'm pretty sure. And the fusion stealing booster is down here as well. I think it's this one. So at this point we have 93. We could raise the fusion ceiling by quite a bit. I can think of this one, I guess. It's just think ahead. I don't know how much this I'm gonna get through today. I might go up to like <laughs> that was pretty funny. I don't know if you saw that, but that was really amazing. Uh, I might do the well, like up to the well where you release Krishna, maybe. Because that's the end of the dungeon after this one. <laughs> This is sweat possible. 
So when we come to this, we are at level 10. Let me save the game here first before I think of apps you can play. Not yet. Um, I don't know. I think I'll get there at least for, uh, at least as far as routing goes. I might, uh, <laughs> jump ahead to near the end of the game. We'll see. I mean, the thing is, I literally have nothing to do. I could just sit here until like midnight or when I have to go to sleep for tomorrow. But, yeah, let's see. Alright, that's okay. Please. Um, yeah, I mean, I feel like I probably should stream for a while while I have nothing to do. Oh, hello. It's been dinner. What's up, buddy? Uh, yeah. Yeah, like, I'm just gonna stream routing, like, a little bit longer until the end of the next dungeon, but I can, like, still do other stuff as well. So we can get up to three, which would let us get much deeper. It might be really good to get this one. Although, it can't use fire well, which is good for the boss we're currently fighting. Okay, get this. This is posted to me, I think. I'm not entirely sure. This could be really good for, like, both the current boss and See what uh, skill it learns. Because if it learns something good, then this game could be really nice. Its magic is really high, so. And it has high agility as well. Alright, let's try this. See how it goes. Alright, yeah. Although we did just waste all our. At points, boosting the fusion seal that we did need. Let's, let's just re reload it and do that again. Yeah, I mean, it, it doesn't really matter what order you do those in for the all ending song. I mean, you're going to get the world record anyway, regardless of what you do, so it really doesn't matter. But, should be good for kick thrust at least. Yeah, like the first run is gonna be the worst by far, so go. Yeah, we should do the coming boss. Uh we might need to restore main characters MP for it. Yeah. I think that should be
これが湧き水を独り占めしてるちょっと気分屋の子ですかのぞみとあっなんて言ったのか聞こえるあのえっとあなたどうしてそこここはこここの後のこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこのこめんどくさいこうらせてやるヒーハー Yeah, that's fine. I mean, the second real boss isn't really that story relevant either. You can at least watch up to the... After we release Krishna. I think mean, that would be good. And you might want to avoid the rest of the spoilers. But yeah. So, this is the most broken thing in the game. You can just like watch and see how big it is. But、uh, down there where it says max, there's a partner meter that builds up、uh, every time like, you,、uh, the partner uses an action. And when it reaches max, it skips your entire enemy's next turn, fully heals and busts you. And then、uh, if they do a lot of damage, it's lost. It's ridiculously broken. I wish you weren't in the game. But... You'll see what I mean in just a moment, probably.、Uh, what does this do? <laughs> Didn't he have no problem? So watch this broken thing go down here. So the entire enemy's turn gets broken. We get healed up. Give up the party. And then they all go attack the boss. Absolutely s t u p i Oh, and then they give a bunch of random smirks to your party as well. Yeah, I agree. That is pretty bullshit. Like, we're probably, like, he's in red health. We're almost done with this, and he hasn't even gotten a chance to do anything yet. Aw,、oh, we just barely didn't beat him. I didn't even do anything. We just beat him. Like, that's absolutely stupid. Like, I know this is easy difficulty because of routing, but I mean, come on. Uh. I think we'll bring that down. Now, these two have a talk. This has some kind of plot relevance for brought the main character back, but I don't really understand. That quest, so fun. Love the game. Alright, this is. Uh, 
I'm not really sure. That's like Bond. The Bond thing. Is this the thing that removes the mark from the I think it might be. I kind of remember this actually. Yeah, I don't know. She doesn't really do any damage with this anyway because of the minus thing, so. Um, would it count as mainline? I mean, I guess so. It's like. It's still part of the mainline, even though it's kind of a spin off like Strange Journey or something. But. It's, it's sort of weird because it's a sequel to one of the uh, SMT4 games. It's like the second half of it, honestly. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I heard that, that it was like going to be, but then it wasn't for some reason. I mean, Strange Journey is a fun game, I have it, so like. I love that flag, by the way. It's just like, oh, hey, go back to the bar to turn in the quest. It makes a lot more sense than to say, oh, hey, go look, whatever. Right, yeah. But this is kind of a weird reason, honestly. Oh, this is the part where we meet Odin. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Uh, white stone. Why she know Hana? Nothing else in this life, honestly. He looks way better than the purple guy. Whatever. He's telling us we have to go to the well to awaken Krishna. some money. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. You see, this is why this is so great, because if I were, even if I were playing in English on regular SMT4, I just have to check all of them to find where I'm supposed to go. And now I just go where I'll take the turn to win the first, I guess. Uh, Alright, we can open the shutter now because we're on this side of it.
This is a pretty cool dungeon as well. I like all of the dungeons in this game that they added. They reused a lot of them. Kanda Yashiro. この Demons are fighting or something like that. Oh yeah, they brought back the healing fountain. Actually, it might be a good idea to heal. I forgot to refill the main hero that I did a lot of damage with this. Instead of paying like a certain amount of money for each if you're MP, she heals, she just has a flat fee though. Correctly, if you go up here, the waterfall dumps you back at the front of the dungeon. I don't really get, but do I have to get them there. Hmm. What are these weak to? I know these two are weak. They're all weak to electric, right? It's also good, good to build up a few actions on the whatever ally so that you can bring uh, enemy bosses and attack later. Another big problem is that I don't know what any of these do. Because there's no way to check. If I had to guess, it would be like some kind of fire resist or fire attack or something. 
Yeah, that's a Suku Kaja. Hmm. That's really nice to have. I don't think the main character needs it though. There's a door back up there. Oh yeah, you showed me. Okay. Oh yeah, there's also this guy already. I mean, in the first game, he was like the king of the swamp or whatever. It just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Okay, so now we can come fight these guys. Uh, I don't know. Okay. We are supposed to take a fight with them, I think. I forgot these are weak, too. Uh, this one's usually weak to kill. Okay, yeah. I don't think I'm going to work. Hey, okay. oh, that works. Nice. That's really good. Cool. Not that one here. You guys have more HP than I thought they would. That sucks. Oh yeah, he is. He's a really cool game, by the way. I mean, this isn't even a regular boss, this is just a mini boss. Okay, I need to be here. Call me to love. Yeah, you know, I'm pretty sure you could believe in the auto battle because the uh, DP battle has a deal on us. Just auto battle I need to be able to No reason not to, honestly. Uh, 
I know we have to be level 13 to uh, 15, sorry, to recruit the mermaid, which, yeah, probably gonna wanna do. <laughs> Great enemy. OBS can't handle this, rendering all of this. Okay, so it's this one. This is really, really important. Thanks, I really this. Maybe, yeah. It would just because it would go a lot faster in your game plus for sure. Would it be better to have Dina or something like Tarkov Kaja? I mean this only works for physical attack, like they split physical and magic like in Nocturne again. But I don't really know. You know, probably not work this time. Okay, we got messed up again. That can recruit mermaid if I need to. We still haven't spent any up. And it might be good to get the skill expanders over here. 
you don't really need anything else at this stage of the game. Let me just save to make sure I'm going to find something crappier. Just make sure I bought the right one first. Uh, yes, I did. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's a nice scroll there. thing is they don't let you get any more uh, skill slots for your, yourself or your demons until a certain part of the game. Like they literally won't let you. So right now I can only get five slots. I can't hoard all my at once to get eight. Kind of strange. It was never one of the more overpowered things in this game anyway. without any gathering. Okay, close enough. This is why we keep Angel with whatever that skill is. There's another demon beyond here. Angel, I guess. Angel has way too much MP right now. This is where you fight Ose. Forget if you have any weak. Try everything. about this game is that a lot of the bosses seem really easy. I mean, I know this is, like, not supposed to be a tough one, but... Oh, what? Please. The final boss is really, really well done. Okay. 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 Oh, 
love how the six pieces sometimes doesn't look. Yeah, he's already alone. So now we beat the Law and Chaos uh, representatives, I guess they would be fun. Half of this battle is just making sure we don't die of police. Oh, he's begging for his life. Uh, I forget which one is make you my team. I know the bottom one is like, don't let him go, I guess. Uh, That's the one I thought I was. Oh, he was too high level so we get this guy instead. That's fine. We should probably heal. Or is it very fun? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I was about to say, unless you got the money DLC. That's very, very easy. Okay. Sure, if any of these would be worthwhile to recruit. I mean, like I said, maybe this one, but other than that, the thing is, I don't know a lot about this game because no one who speaks the English language has played this. So this is very, very tricky to get the information I need at times. I can at least try and recruit that a lot of the comfort maybe. Um I'm honestly not sure. I'll have to see. Uh because I might I might have to get a different 3DS and use my money on that. Because right now you can't really tell because of my capture card that the screen on my 3DS is cracked. And there's like a big black square across most of the screen, like some colored bars. So I probably have to get a new one to play most of my other games on. So 
Maybe, maybe not. It's probably not worth it. I'll at least like watch a playthrough or something. this dialogue. Okay. Look at the waterfall again. Even if you say yes, you just look at the waterfall. I don't get it. Reset because this is clearly. I mean, like, actually, it's just not supposed to. Well. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Help? Help? Do both of these do the same thing? I don't think there's anything. I don't have to reset, but like. Let's. Hello? I don't know, dude. Alright, well, I'll we'll just reset the whole console. You know, might as well be sure. Launcher and start up again. <laughs> I don't know. All right, I forgot the delightful epilepsy it gives you. Let's load that again and not softwalk again. Uh, no it doesn't. I used a special, like, uh, a set of actions to go to the homebrew screen while it, the DS was starting up. You can still use your 3DS normally. Alright, it looks like I'm supposed to go here. Oh, they just give you the power source right next to the wall. This is very, very necessary. Okay, now we literally walk a couple feet. And we bend them over there. Great puzzle. Great puzzle. Okay. Um. Oh, I didn't even see that thing over there. We have 100% of these. That's pretty good. 
They just give you 100% evasion on easy, is that how this works? Is it so? That's hilarious. Uh, this just completes the whole I think we go down here. Or not. Oh, hey, it's murder. Let's recruit one. Oh, we just ran away. That's fine. <laughs> oh, right. So, you remember in SMT4 when the hand would start grabbing? This is the other point right now. Where you just... It pauses the rest of the game, so it doesn't even work as a trap anymore. Then you just have to bash X until you get out of it. I don't even know what it's supposed to be. You can even get an encounter while you're in it, so... What's the point? Oh, so we have to use... Go back, get Navari. Bring him all the way over there. It's not even like a fun puzzle, it's just like a chore you have to do. I mean, most of the games are pretty solid, it's just these random dungeon elements. They try to make it interesting, and it's just not what I don't like about it. Try up this ladder, maybe. Or is this? Yeah, I mean, the old loop for design was good, but I think they did a good job revamping it in this game. Like, I mean, that's not P4 vanilla, it's definitely like, really weird, but... I mean, that's probably where I'm gonna stop this. Oh. Where I'm gonna like stop routing for now at least. Uh, I mean, the thing is, like, streaming kind of sucks in that, like, uh, like, you could be doing something else too. So, if I'm not rallying, then I don't even know.
right. Every time you beat a horse, there's like always a second one. It needs a lot more experience, but... Because you still can't run away from me. Oh, and the thing with uh, Hamabudo though is that if you're smirking, you can still like, kill him. So, it's like an incentive to get your allies smirking. That's the one here. Yeah, I guess that released the lock on whatever that other one was. Too after this, I might want to like record a few parts of the walkthrough. Might get that going. I might be going better than streaming, honestly. This thing has really good magic. I kind of want this. But I would have to get rid of each one, which I don't want to get. Really cool if we could use this. Because, like, uh, the boss, upcoming boss, is weak to you. So, if we get this guy, it's just a lot easier. That might be good. Mm. So, I should spend that points raising the piece of ceiling by two. Now, come on. That's this one. Raise by one, raise by two. Okay. Now we check. Alright, now I can use this guy. That's a really good idea. Why not just get the This is actually pretty easy. Now what should I use for my party? Probably this guy, Angel. If we can make a third one right now, that'd be really cool. Oh yeah, there's also this kind of fusion where you can just check what things will fuse into by selecting two from the menu. Uh, this one's great. Now there's this one. This one's a lot better though. They use the angel, so it doesn't matter. This is actually Naga. That'd be really nice. To get this. Hang on, let me just 
How many out points do we have at this point in the game? Because there's nothing that oh, come we on. Could really spend it on. Let's see. We can definitely get three. And then fuse that one. That'd probably be the best call. Alright, now I can get this one, which does a lot of physical and gun damage. Can't use fire that well, but it's whatever. Alright, let's see. Now we're well on our way to getting level 2 spells, so I think that's a good setup. Like that, yeah. It sucks that we can't pass the other to something else, but we did make this guy, so we should be okay. Alright, okay, let's see. The latest demon that's early game. Um, I don't really know. Like, Oh, are you talking about a demon that's usually early game that appears late? Oh, I really have no idea. I forget what level you find clan deer again. But... Oh, Look towards this sphere. If you look at it in 3D mode, it's like. Oh, early game, but normally late. Um, I don't know, it's kind of hard to say. I mean, Zekarabia is probably the best example, and he's already passed uh, hmm. all the angels are still in order. Uh, hmm. I really don't know. Like, I. Don't remember much of the early game for this, so I can't really say. Fight okay. Canoe Man. Yeah, that's fine. I wouldn't expect you to stay on it. Wow, that did a lot of damage. have enough points to break again. The blind ailment in this game is really weird. Like you see, now that it's blinded over there. Basically the first time you try to do something, it doesn't work, and then it's always healed by the next turn. 
that it has. Wow, that causes the blind tail. It's not often you see bosses have like ailments because no one uses them. And we're at max ult, so this guy is just dead. Yeah, that's it. Oh, that's uh, it's absolutely destroyed. Alright. So if you want to leave, now is probably the time. I love Chris in this game, he's such a cool one. Oh. で終戦立ては済んだ。これで流れ変わる。さあ、現在する神々に号令を僕ら多神連合の救済を開始しよう。
小僧これから忙しくなるぞ覚悟をしておけ君君は一体何者だ今のやり取りはフリンクはどうなるああひょっとして私はとんでもないやつについてしまったのかまずいよナナシ私たち利用されたんだこんなのってないよ私はただ一人前って認めてもらいたくてなのに銀座に着いた念のため紹介に応援を要請しておいたよでも応援が来るまで待ってられないよね早くフリンを見つけよう大丈夫立ちくらみああれフリンじゃないおいフリン
はじめましてクリ僕は多神連合が一柱クリシュナ僕ら多神連合はこの世界を救済するために集った同志だ救済お前たちは一体僕はルシファーやメルカバーとは違う僕ら多神連合は彼らとは相いれないルシファーにもメルカバーにも組みさない第三の勢力ということかしら<笑>そう受け取ってもらって構わないこの世界は唯一神を名乗ってはばからない創造主によって支配されている奴は僕らを一心とそしるばかりか人間を肉に封じ空で囲い言葉で縛った創造主は我らやケイラの愛を自分に都合のよいようねじ曲げているのかそんな勝手許せないだろうだから僕らは奴を倒そうと考えているフリン君にはその協力をしてほしい僕らの救世主カルキになってくれないか人々を救済するために僕と共に来てくれ僕が断ったとしたらった場合は仕方ない力づくで行かせてもらうおおさすがは我らが救世主だ今の攻撃をかわすぞだが。この娘の首がどうから離れることになるぞ<笑>私は多神連合が一走り見ろ遅かったなミロクだが君がここに来たということは築地金願寺はすでに我々多神連合だ素晴らしいあとは僕らのカルキにボソクロを願うなそう思うけどプリンドン我々に従ってもらおうこの娘がどうなってもよいというなら安心を別に
私は大丈夫ですでも不倫が<笑>おいおいおいなんだよあれどうなってるんだあれは不倫じゃないかあの悪魔何をしているの不倫大丈夫か他の奴らにも声をかけた加勢するぜおい悪魔ども不倫は俺たちの希望変な真似はさせねえぞ学級採用この悪魔ども人外ハンターをなめんじゃないわよ俺らを救うメルカバーとルシファーを倒してから行ってもらいたいものだなそんなものは救済の過程に過ぎない僕らの目的はもっと深遠本質的だ君たちを救済へと導く大蛇さ手始めにこの使衛者が君たちに僕らの力を見せよう僕は君たちの光だ<笑>おいおいあれ花が開いてる天井から光がこれって空が見える空あれが空か<笑>人間諸君君たちの希望の星不倫は僕と共にある光を求めるなら築地懇願寺に迎え僕らはそこで君たちの来訪を待つ起源は次の漫画月が空に満ちた時僕らは創造主が作った世界を脱し君たちを新たな宇宙へいざなうさあ共に新たな宇宙へ旅立とう<笑>待って。多神連合を名乗る悪魔たちにより不倫が連れ去られ状況は一変した今東京はルシファーとメルカバーそして多神連合とで三つどめの状態だ彼らは現在人間を囲うように各町の地上部を占領しているルシファーは市ヶ谷駐屯地新宿渋谷メルカバーはスカイタワー錦糸町
上野池袋多神連合は銀座築地懇願寺勢力図だけ見れば拮抗しているが実情はそうではない多神連合が放った神出鬼没の大蛇聖者により天使と悪魔は防戦一方だ相手の本拠地を叩きに大軍を動かせば手薄になったところを突かれる先に聖者を撃とうとしても出現位置が不明なため兵を動かせないいつどこに出現するかわからないためどうしても対応が後手に回ってしまう今のところ聖者に対して有効な手立ては見つかっていない聖者いつどこで襲われるかわからないってそんなのどうしようってんだよ天使に悪魔に聖者クソ今の東京に安全な場所はないのかもし多神連合についてってこんな世界から出せられるなら私<咳>こんな状況では多神連合についた方が安全と考えるものが出るのも当然だ希望の星である不倫が不在の今聞こえのいい言葉に惹かれるのはわかるだが多神連合の言う救済が実際にどういったものなのか不明なままだ僕は不倫を無理やりに連れ去ったやつを信用することはできないフリシノが言う希望などまやかしだ人間はどの神や悪魔にも屈してはいけない奴らに対抗するためにも俺たちは団結し不倫を救出しなくてはならない不倫の救出作戦を進める下準備として君たちには各町へ補給物資を届けてもらう東京はどこも今まで以上に危険な状態だ君たちの健闘を祈る検討を祈るって言われてもよこれは身の振り方を考えないとまずいな不倫もいなくなって私たちこれから一体どうすればいいの神々の戦争の巻き添えで死ぬなんてまっぴらごめんだぜこれからどうなっちゃうんだろう私たちどうすれば人間たちは神々の動向によっていいように翻弄されているなよく見ておけ、小僧。これが神や悪魔の本質だ。人間を翻弄し、支配し、操作する。神はそれしか考えていない。ということだ。朝日、七子、ちょっと来い。ほら、おめえらが運ぶ補給物資だ。話が早いねありがとう親父仕事場では親父って呼ぶな何度も言ってるだろうがうんありがとうございますマスターはあ、なってるな気ぃつけていけよんうん行ってくるおいおいおいおい君たち本気かあの大蛇に襲われたらどうするのだあんなのに襲われたら死んでしまうぞわざわざ命を危険そうであろうこれからはちゃんと自分ダメだなそうお前にはこれから存分に動いてもらうそして神と悪魔人間という存在がいかにくだらぬ存在か身をもって知るのだいいか俺の神殺したるお前に選択肢はない今は流れのまま人間と共に多神連合と戦い時が来たら神殺しであるお前のなすべきことを教えてやるマナシ何してるのもう出発するよ
私に追いついたか幽霊ではあるまいだ。いや、君たち。あなたは誰ですか？私の名はスティーブ。あの子が興味を抱いているということは、君たちもまた未来を選択するものなんだね。この者は何を言っているのだ？いずれわかるよ。これから君たち人間は神や悪魔により大いに惑わされるだろう彼らは自分に都合のよい結末を迎えるため君たちを誘惑し脅迫し迷わせる時には君たちに原子を見せたり人間に化けて出ることさえあるだろうさあ君たちはどうする彼らの思惑に乗るか中央の道を選ぶか中央の道それってどういうもし君たちが中央の道を求めるならば私がその手助けをしてあげようこの町はすでに大蛇に襲撃され多くの人間が魂ごと食われてしまったえそれってどういうことすでに襲撃されたってすべては君たち自身が決めていくことだ頑張りたまえ期待しているなんだったんだろうあの人
聖者がここに近くにいるハンターは迎撃に当たるって聖者がいる場所は都庁広場広場には地下街を通っていくみたい急ごうナナシ